Hi there guys. It's almost half past six in the evening. I feel like, I feel like the past couple of two days, her sleep pattern has changed. So not changed like in a bad way. During the daytime from like 11 or 12, all the way up to like six o'clock, she'll like have like a nap, like one nap and she's awake for most of the hours but like now we've just we just come back from the shops and like she's been awake ever since we came back from the shops what like over an hour ago yeah she's not settled back to sleep so that means she's gonna sleep really really soon which is actually really good because i need to go and make dinner so when i'm yeah that's it again as well when i make when, when i by the time i start cooking dinner she's already like gone down to sleep which is great because you know who, who wants to like have a crying baby in the background and you're trying to fry stuff um i've got another one the other one my one-year-old he's also taking a little nap but you know he's taking a nap because <laughs> the kid wants to go to every single car ride you know those car rides in like shopping centers or your like your local one of those big food stores like your big tesco as the store or mostly my sainsbury store um all the Sainsbury stores that I go to have them. You know those car rides, you put a coin in, you can now you use your car to tap and like your kid can go for a ride on the car. He wants to go to every single car. And where we do our food shop, there's like at least eight cars around the corner, in like nearly every single corner you go to. You can't you can't go to Primark without passing a few cars. You can't leave Sainsbury's without passing those toy those cars. You enter into the shopping center and there's Peppa Pig. Behind Peppa Pig, there's Thomas the Tank Engine car ride or toy ride. You you can't go past it. So this kid wants to go to every toy ride. The last store we went to was Poundland. Yeah. I was I was I've got one more shop to go to. Poundland. Let me get the batteries and the yeah, this. Couldn't get to Poundland because he was in a car and I was like, okay, you can go on it. When I say go on it, not, not go on it as like I'm paying money. I took him to a car ride yesterday and I paid money. I'm not paying money in these car rides every single time I go to. I know it's at like £1.50, £1.25. That adds up. Don't be like, oh, you just allow. No, it adds up, my love. It adds up. Literally, sometimes I'll take him to a car ride and I'll pay. And then if he sees another car ride, I'm like, okay, let's just sit in it let's just sit we're not we're not paying but i allow you to sit you know turn the wheel a little bit we're, we're not paying but literally we, we went into the last store which was pound nine and he was crying to the point where literally a lady looked at me and was like oh i said oh he's crying over cars like he was crying to the point where <laughs> He was crying in Poundland. He cried when we went to the checkout to pay for our stuff. He cried while we're leaving the store. He cried all the way to the traffic lights across the road. And he calmed down when we got to the train station. And like, we got on the train and I held him. Because the kid kept on crying so much, he got tired. And so I'm pushing a pram. This one's in the pram and I'm holding my other son like this. Yeah, But I'm on the market for a push chair. I'm getting a double pram. Yes, but I don't want those long push jets. I don't want them. I've had them before and they've not, they're not. Last time I had it, it was not great for my back. And on top of that, I brought the, a long one. It literally broke on me while doing a food shop. The wheel broke while we're doing a food shop. It's not funny, not funny. So I'm like, I'm not getting a long push jet. Also the wheel thing, it could be any push jet. But it, it was a push jet I got from eBay. There you go. One thing for sure, I am so glad to be back home. So glad to be back home. It was so cold today. I went out. I went out with no socks on. I haven't been wearing my... Lately, I don't... When I go out, I don't wear socks. <laughs> I know we're having like, a conversation about socks. Today, I felt the cold. I was like, oh, you'll get... Ooh, don't you ever do this again. We need to come outside with socks literally a few minutes ago i was like i need to put i need my cardigan my pajama cardigan um and i need to put on some socks and like you know like when it gets to that winter time these there's like small things that you're like oh it's just so you just appreciate yeah i appreciate just having a cardigan radiator on radiator is currently on oh you, you better count your blessings if you're someone who can put the radiator on and on top of that some socks on i really appreciate that oh i appreciate that <laughs>
so the youngest ones have fallen asleep i think i explained in like my recent video i'm just in this phase in my head where it's like i just really want to get things done and like i know i obviously because i've just had a baby you're supposed to take things slow but when you have that small like burst of energy take that opportunity because it's bedtime and the baby is asleep I'm just gonna have a 15 minute 15 not 50 15 50 minutes is like oh my goodness 15 minutes sleep is like really precious <laughs> it is so precious seriously even just 30 minutes just lying down i have I'm seriously appreciating anyway so i'm gonna do a 15 minutes um clean of my room and the kids room combined as well let me go and get the broomstick because my room needs a little clean Thank you.